I know I'm like a year late for this. Friends let me borrow his Pulse Explorer wireless earbuds, you know, the Sony earbuds. And so I wanted to talk about it because why not? So just, you know, he got some instructions that are hard to get out. These are not easy to understand at all. You got the Sony Buds themselves. Wow, there we go. Looks like a mini PS5. And then you got some earbud tips and this USB-C. This is what you plug into the PS5 itself. So the headphones will work with the PS5. Here again are the buds. They're magnetic, very similar to AirPods in the sense that the case itself is magnetic. The buds magnetize into the case, just not as easily as the AirPods. And that is fairly satisfying. The device itself is not as clean as the AirPods. Obviously it's bigger and you can actually see the magnets. You can see where they attach to each other. But for what it is, it's pretty cool. I've been playing with these headphones for a few days now, and the best answer I can give is they're okay. For $200, what are you getting? So you're able to use these as regular headphones for Bluetooth for your phone. They're fine. Ironically, they stay better in my ear, better than the AirPods Pro do, but they're so ugly in your ear. They look so bad, they're not sleek at all. Granted, I'm not seeing them unless I look in the mirror, so it doesn't really matter unless you really care about how other people view you. I mean, I'm wearing a pumpkin pie shirt, so you know. So that's one thing. Also, the microphone quality is kind of abysmal. It's not the worst, but it's, again, nowhere near AirPods Pro level stuff. And I would say I can't compare this to AirPods because AirPods are so much higher quality. These are $200. AirPods Pro are $250 and they're typically on sale for 200, if not less. So why would you go for these? Now, maybe the gaming aspect of it is a lot better. So I hooked this up to my PS5 and it comes with this handy dandy little USB dongle. You plug this into the PS5 and this is essentially like a little Bluetooth adapter that will connect these with this, which is this is plugged into the PS5. So the way you do it is you plug this in, you press this button here on the top of the little case and it'll connect them. Funnily enough, the button on the buttons on the earbuds themselves don't work when they're plugged into your phone or hooked up to your phone. The two volume buttons up top and this little feature button on the bottom don't work at all when connected to the phone. They only work on the PS5. On the PS5, you double click the bottom button and that'll bring you to the sound menu. And that gives you different sound options. It gives you bass boost, standard, shooter. And I played with them. They're not really that different. Maybe for somebody who has a better ear than I do, they would be. But honestly, they sounded really good. I played some Spider-Man, I played some Astro Bot, and all in all, even just being on the PS5 home screen, that nice music, it sounded really good. At one point, I didn't realize the headphones were in my ears. I didn't realize it wasn't coming from my soundbar, it was coming from the headphones. So that's how good they are in that sense. They they do very good at giving you that surround sound feel, but when I have headphones in both my ears, my ears get really itchy. And so that's kind of the, hey, you're wearing headphones reminder type thing. Now, you know, if I really want to play on my PS5 and my wife was asleep or something, these are a really good option if I don't want to be loud. The thing I keep running into is I already have AirPods Pro. So if I wasn't, given these to borrow by a friend, I would have never bought these. So if you have any AirPods, you want to connect your AirPods to your PS5. Unfortunately, you can't. The PS5 doesn't have Bluetooth, but you can buy a similar dongle to this on Amazon for 30 bucks from Ugreen, and they're not a sponsor or anything. Essentially, I didn't buy it, but from the research I've done, they do the exact same thing. So if you already have AirPods, you're an Apple user, or you're on the fence, you want to buy AirPods, but you also kind of want to buy these, you play video games a lot, get the AirPods. They're gonna work so good for your iPhone, obviously, but also they're going to be able to work on your PS5. They're not going to be PS5 proprietary, so it's not gonna give you the different sound options, but for what AirPods are, the sound quality is already good enough. 
I played some Spider-Man with this and I watched the dramatic cutscene in the game. I did some swinging around town in the game. It still just felt like the standard playing video games and I have sound, but the only difference was my ears were a lot more itchy than usual because I had both headphones in. So that is my thoughts on the Pulse Wireless Earbuds Explore. I don't know why they're called Explore because Bluetooth to the phone felt like an afterthought, but here we go. And I'm not really exploring if I'm playing my PS5 because my TV is stationary even though my headphones aren't. So that's my thoughts. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And if you want to know how I customize my PS5 and a controller, let me know in the comments down below. Until next time, I'm Jake. This is Shot on My Phone.